I'm Mark Donovan from HomeEditionPlus.com and today I'm going to talk to you about attic ventilation systems. Attic ventilation systems basically consist of uh, uh, soffit venting and uh, roof venting. And in this particular case, what you see here is ridge vent. Uh, the ridge vent works in tandem with the soffit vent to basically allow cool air to circulate in or come in through the soffit vent that sits in the roof eaves um, and for that cool air to basically um, circulate in the attic and then as it warms up, um, be expelled through the ridge vent. Um, the ventilation system in an attic is critical for extending the life of the shingles um, as well as removing the heat, particularly the hot heat during the summer, um, so that the home is more comfortable in the living spaces. In addition, um, an attic ventilation system is even critical in the winter time for, from removing um, moist warm air that can sometimes penetrate up in, from the living space into the attic area that warm moist air stays trapped in the attic, um, ice dams form um, and you wind up having water or rain or melted snow back up underneath the shingles and causing water damage in the home. As you can see, a ridge vent extends almost the entire length of the ridge. Roofing shingle tabs are fastened on top of the ridge vent material and is secured into place with roofing nails. As you can see, only at the very far end of the ridge vent are there actually nails exposed. And those nails are actually sealed with a roofing sealant to prevent any types of leaks from coming into the uh, attic area. The second major component of the attic ventilation system is soffit vent. As you can see here, the soffit vent sits in the eaves or underside eaves of the uh, roof. And in this case, it's a continuous uh, type soffit vent. There are also individual soffit vents, such as these circular styles, that again sit on the underside of the eaves. And then finally, there's the rectangular soffit vent that sits again on the underside of the eaves. The actual amount of attic ventilation system required is a function of how much attic ceiling space there is in the attic. Uh, typically you need one square foot of attic ventilation system for every 300 square feet of uh, vaporized barrier attic, insul attic ceiling area. Um, if you use non-continuous um, ventilation systems such as individual soffit vents um, or mushroom cap um, or turbine type um, ventilation systems on the roof, then the ratio is one square foot of attic um, ventilation system required for every 150 square feet of um, attic ceiling space in the attic. So those are the basics of an attic ventilation system. If you have other home improvement questions, visit us at homeeditionplus.com today.